you know, come back again, you know, fall kill again. We'll start out with this area right here. And this area is called the hunt. 78, there's only a handful we can access. The rest of them are all animal. So, before we, so, we use a brown dog out right there, his name's Jeff. Jeff will chase him into that hole. Mm -hmm. We're fine, we crawl through this. Now, uh, this, I'm gonna straight up down. So think of that as a mud slide. You come out, we line you up, let you slide all the way into another room back here. Once you're in that bottom room, four tons. She is dense, very heavy. Wow. This whole rock right here is estimated 350 to 380 tons. Just wow. right. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. So you get one, two, three. Wow. And it's our head right now. This never stops stripping. Wow, that's so cool. That's good water, too. Yeah. Now, these guys here become water cannons. One inch right at the top is three feet down here. So water literally blasts out of these holes. On that one, we don't know how far that one goes, how deep, or anything yet. We're still working on that one. Yeah. But the chamber you guys are standing on now goes all the way to that back wall, all the way down past this. And this chamber right through here drops 60 to 80 feet. Holy. You need to know your history so you don't repeat it. Exactly. I... And you know, if you look back at history, we did a lot of dumb things. So we don't want to really warm. Your chimney is right there. Yeah. yeah. So all that black is soot. The last piece that fell out of was dated 7,500 years. Oh. Wow. So we've been down here a long time. And then he's back. Now, but right, right here, this is a nice piece of emerald. And there's your little piece of sapphire. And let's see if I can find some water. See? The oh, yeah. Now that water's drinkable too. Now, so if you're ever trapped in a cave, you look for that. You go find that. There's no window licking. It's right. creates pressure coming up. Fresh air from the top comes around. It basically makes a bubble, and that's what cools your air. It's nature's version of a hyperbaric chamber. <laughs> Well, I'll tell you what, we don't have, we just had a little bit of rain, just enough to make it muddy last night. Yep, it's like clay. Yes. <laughs> so, July and August. <laughs> right. Okay. Hold on to hand real bit, man. Does that sound fans or, or water? That's water. Wow. Whoa, water. Whoa. Yes, it is very cool and watery. Yeah. Right now, back there is five to eight thousand back. You gotta go over the bridge, you go around, it opens up just like this. But we crawl in there. That water is way steep, it is 51 degrees year round. Way steep. Oh, yeah. Now, as long as you're moving around, it's gonna feel fine. Actually, it'll feel warmer in the water than out of it. Okay, because you're crawling, you're not just standing still. You see how dark it is? It yeah. is beautiful yeah. in there. Mm -hmm. Oh, when I turn this out. Oh, oh wow. Millions and millions of years old. Yes. Uh huh. So, hey you guys. They're looking for food, they ain't bringing any with me. Very pretty indeed. Hey, yeah. Mm -hmm. so, yeah, this is what the Indians got. Oh, yeah. Eastern Tennessee fall line. That's pretty. Wow. Now, you guys are standing on pieces of iron oxide. That's rust. We'll stain everything. So now you see. Now, these, they believe, are somewhere around 500 years old. And the Indians, they were making a map. Hmm. So when they old, like a gnome? Fargos? Yeah. I don't know. See? Uh, you got a, a hat, gnome? his ears. Yeah, oh, yeah. No. Yeah, yeah. No, yeah. This that's really cool. Yeah, and it's the stuff right here. Now he does have a lot of lint because people are hugging on him. Yeah, I saw that. Huh? Fly. I saw that fly. Oh, you saw him? Yeah. Yeah. Come through to get in your picture. Yes. The wave. Yeah. Whoa, wave. Yep, and you can see where the earthquake separated it. Okay. So between the water and the earthquakes, this was not the place to hang out. <laughs> oh, you're a your pumpkin. That's gonna be future surge guys. Yeah. You can tell the way the water come in. We'll just cut away into the rock. 
But then as your water started dropping, that's when all this started forming. Yeah. So. Water wow, that is crazy breeze. You're good, yeah. Laser yeah. yeah. there. Yeah. Because of right here, the Native Americans. Now, this was. Just push them up. Mm -hmm. That's why when you look in there, so you see on this side, you see how smooth it is here? Mm -hmm. But it's not here. Well, that tells right. you this was in the water, this was out of the water. Yeah. So when the plate shifted, it actually dropped. And that's where you got this uneven. But if you could push these two sides together, you could see this would ride right here all the way down. What about the line? Exactly what it is, yeah, but you see how this was carved? Yeah. That's writing. That oh. is actually Nordic. Oh. Uh, it's like a half moon backwards. Um, this right here goes down. It looks like almost like a, a hole. I got a swimming pool. All of those symbols were supposed to mean something. We have no idea what. <laughs> so they come down, got uh, some castings of it. They're going to figure out what it is. They believe that was Nordic. Huh. Well, we didn't have Vikings here. So that would have put this back around the Pangea stage wow. before the continent split. Wow. Mm. So that could be fascinating. And that would.